I mean, why would somebody volunteer that? <laughs> Do you think that makes you more or less valuable in the eyes of the world that, that you got arrested for resisting arrest, they kept your car for 30 days, you had to bail your car out, and then gratuitously telling me, I did it again. <laughs> A couple of months twice. Why did you, do you think that that's important? You think that that makes you terrific? I mean, I don't no. understand. No, I'm just saying. Just saying? I'm just saying. Well, how did it come about that she paid the money to get your car out of impound? She said she'd get my car out of the impound as soon as it was done. So she used her credit card and got the car out. Why didn't you use your I credit never, I never forced her to. Why didn't you use your credit card? I don't have a credit card. And you don't have a credit card because? Because I don't have any credit. Uh, that's the reason. Mm -hmm. What are you studying? A Harvard student. A what? I'm still in high school. How old are you? I'm 18. How old are you? 23. Do you live at home? Yes. With parents? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh is not an answer. Yes. Do they know he's got a little bit of a violent side? Yes. They know that? Do they approve of him? Yeah. Do they know that he takes advantage of women? Well, I don't think it's taking advantage of women. You don't think taking money from somebody who... Stand up. I just want to tell you something. Because you're 18, I actually can say this to you. Move over. While he was your boyfriend, I want you to think about the very, very strong probability that he was hooking up with his friend. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Really strong. Because... Otherwise, she's not giving him $4,000. Do you understand that? So not only do you now know that he was arrested at least twice for resisting arrest, which is pretty sort of violent behavior. I mean, it's not she as was if there you took a newspaper. She was there both times? She was there one of the times because I ran from the car. <laughs> so you know that. And I'm also telling you, because that's what the plaintiff told me, that they were together in January of this year when he was supposed to be your boyfriend. Is that registering with you? Yes. How much did you pay to get his car out of impound? I paid 3325 Listen, the cops kept your car in impound for 30 days. Do you know why? No. To teach you a lesson. <laughs> There's no other reason to keep your car in impound. Right. They said, all right, you're going to create difficulty for us. We're going to create difficulty for you. So we're going to keep your car in impound. It's going to cost you, this little escapade is going to cost you a few thousand dollars. That was your punishment. You can't pay somebody else to do your time. That was the quid pro quo for whatever went on at the time. By the way, what happened with that charge? Just curious. Um, um is not an answer. I got community service hours. How many hours? 80 something. And you pled guilty? Yeah. Yes, is the answer. 3325, judgment for the plaintiff. We're done. Goodbye. Thanks. Is excuse, you may step out. He was using me for his own benefit. She offered to pay that whole thing off. He blocked me on everything, and he told me he had a new girlfriend. We're starting a family. Never helped someone. Not for my new family, yeah.